special video for you all here today. We are doing an FST beta drive right through Washington, D.C. All right, so check this out. We are on 395, and this is like the pretty busy part of 395 that goes through um, quite a bit of D.C. We're going to see some uh, historical you know, sites over here as well as some popular uh, areas I'm going to try to point out to you. So um, we are right behind the Capitol building. So to my right is the Capitol and you can see there's like apartment buildings and hotels hanging out in this area. It's where a lot of the, you know, senators and representatives stay, and, you know, visit the Capitol building. People come, you know, and stay in this area right here. This is like, yeah, smack down right around the Capitol, which of course is right around all of our museums, which I think we might even check out one of these architect museums. There's the National Spy Museum, of course, all the Smithsonian's. We've got the Hope Diamond here in DC. A lot of cool stuff you can go visit. But yeah, so far in this video, FSD doing its thing. Check it out, we got the Jefferson Memorial over to our right there a little bit. And uh, far ahead, those buildings that you see is actually Virginia. So that's Arlington, and that's where we're headed. So as soon as, this is like the very end of DC also. So parts that you see in the movies, a lot of times they kind of glance over and um, show this part of DC. I actually had some of my family here from England uh, not too long ago and we drove by and and then I was telling them, oh look, there's the Washington Monument and uh, which is over there to our right. And, so, and someone, one of my cousins said, oh, that's the building from the Spider-Man movie. And I was like, what? <laughs> Are you serious? You know that from the Spider-Man movie? But yeah, that's a pretty important building to us over there. And uh, here we are officially on the bridge. This is the 395 bridge that takes us right into Virginia officially. Um, the metro line runs down here and everything. So this is smack down in the prime of, you know, the DMV area. So I had to be sure to share this drive with you all. And notice the driving is really perfect. There has been no takeovers or anything so far. Um, we are in route to Arlington, so just actually looking to drive through DC, which we are now officially, see where it says enter Arlington County. Now we are in Virginia. To our right is the Pentagon as well. The most, one of the most important buildings in the world. A lot of stuff going on over there. It's our military headquarters and it's shaped like a pentagon. Very cool. Wow, take a look at the way FSD responded to that car that almost just tipped over. Did you see that? Like that was crazy. The car just, first of all, almost smacked into me and I love how FSD just stopped. And yeah, see I was admiring all this, all the beautiful buildings around me and this jeep over here it just just doesn't know how to drive but i love how fsd caught that and yeah really nice job so we are now taking the exit and you know when you plug in your destination fsd does all the driving for you so you don't even have to worry about where you're going but at the same time you do want to be familiar with your roads because it can potentially take the wrong turn this is the Air Force Memorial right here in front of us. This is a great spot to watch the July 4th fireworks, which they do an epic show here in DC. And you will most more than likely catch me over there on 4th of July, maybe. Somewhere around here. But yeah, all in all, what'd you think about the drive? I think it was good. Very smooth, I think so. Um, I think it's... Uh, definitely something everyone should try and experience right now i am still on the fsd trial I'm on the model y here so this is a 2023 model y and they just threw me a free month of fsd 
even though I have it on my Model 3, I just wanted to try it out on this car to see what it's like. So it's it runs really smooth. If you have an FSD capable car, definitely try it out for a month. See what it's like in your commute and um, test it out for yourself. It's kind of hard to tell in the video, even though I tried to show you as close as possible. Nothing is scripted over here. This is all real life and um, I can't make any of this up. So take that for what it's worth. But I highly recommend trying it in real life. Isn't it a lot different, you know, when you're actually sitting through it yeah. than watching a video? It's like, you know, it's hard to, to really, you know, compare until you sit, especially when you sit in the driver's seat. That's a big difference too. And I'm noticing not everyone handle it so let me know what you think about that uh, drop a comment below we are now approaching our destination here and in this video there has been zero takeovers FSD did all the driving there's a big sign right there that says reduce speed ahead and notice how FSD recognize that the speed limit is changing and see how the speed sign is right there and right before we got to it FSD got to 27 and it can avoid you getting a ticket in situations like that if someone's just not paying attention and they just blow past this you know cops are always posted like right there and trying to get people in situations like this where it goes from 55 to 45 to 30 wow really close with that, <laughs> that truck back there but FSD found its footing and actually uh worked its way around there. I see the blue house with the green door. It's so random, but that's really cool. We are now in the smackdown of um, Arlington, if anyone's familiar with the area. And yeah, all in all, it has been a really smooth drive. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. We've got 12.4 coming really soon. Uh, steering wheel nag is going to be removed but notice I don't even think I had like four nags this entire video I'm gonna have to go back and see exactly but yeah look at this so uh, Mr. Electric over here is trying to make a left and miss electric whoa FSD almost hit that car wow but it didn't and I don't know how it knew it had the space to go. It was tar It was giving me a forward collision warning, but it went and thank God I don't get tagged for that because when FSD is driving, it's all on FSD, but oh my God, that was close. That was one of the closest that I've ever come, but FSD knew it had space and it went. Even I couldn't tell. I'm kind of sitting back and it's trying to go left here now and I will not let it, so. That was a mistake it made. And yeah, just like that, you can see FSD can definitely make mistakes and it just happened in this video. And now look, it has to fix itself by making the next left. Thankfully, we're a few minutes early just to give us a chance. And look at this, trying to squeeze in. But still, no takeovers. Here we go with the left turn. Let's see if it can figure it out and it's gonna actually wait for the cars and the pedestrian. I like those, I like this decision, really good decision. L see how FSD even waited for this guy and then went. And just like that, we have pretty much made it to our destination. I wanna thank everyone for watching this video. Hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe for more videos like this and um, updates are coming with the 12.4 the steering wheel nag will be removed so let's see how it does with this right turn real quick and it basically cut off that light by just making like a left 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 right and as soon as it gets the clear away there it goes thanks again for watching and i hope you have a great rest of your day